Welcome back to my channel. It's Live in Color with me, Raven Danielle. And today we're going to talk about growing pains. As human beings, we are trying to grow to be better people. But sometimes growing can be tough. Growing is not easy. Sometimes growing includes pain, it includes heartache, it includes losing things. And that's not something we always talk about, but we have to deal with it. So I want to tell you where I got this from. So this morning, I had to uproot a whole plant. This was a plant that someone had given to me. It was a cactus and it was already starting to die a little. It was falling over and it was brown because it wasn't watered. So I watered the cactus, I put it in the sun and it wasn't working. The brown was just spreading everywhere. So I looked at it last night and I was like, this cactus is going to die if I don't do something drastic. So this morning I got up and I had to uproot it. The first thing I did was I took all of the dead parts and I cut it off. And so here's what the plant looked like before. This is when I started to cut off the dead pieces. Doesn't look good, does it? second thing I had to do, I had to take those green pieces that were left, the green lush pieces that were still alive, and I cut those off and I put them to the side because I wanted to save those. Then, after that, I had to pull up the root. And when I tell you, the root was so hard to pull up. I had to dig so super deep into that pot. And I kept pulling and pulling and it was not coming up. So I had to dig even more. And I got my hand in there really good. And I just kept tugging and I finally gave one good tug and the roots came out. It was a huge ball of roots. And some of these roots were just so thick. They were literally embedded in the bottom of the pot. Once I did that, I kind of cleared out the soil that was around those roots, like any soil that I saw that could have had any mold or anything in it. And then I started to replant the green lush pieces. So I planted those again, and then I watered it and put it in the sunlight. And this is now what it looks like. Just green, lively pieces, which I truly believe is going to grow. So I said all of that to say, a lot of times when we grow, we need to be pruned. We need dead things cut off of us. And when I say dead things, it could be issues, problems, people that we shouldn't be hanging around anymore. We need those things removed out of our lives because if we don't, it spreads to the healthy part of us and then we can't grow. Then we're stagnated and we start to die. And when I say start to die, I don't mean physically. Sometimes part of your personality starts to die out. You're not as vibrant as you used to be. You don't do the things you used to do because that dead part or that poison is starting to affect, infect the whole part of you. So in order to grow, we have to cut out the dead things. We have to know that it's going to hurt. I'm sure if that plant could feel what I was doing when I was pulling out those roots, I'm sure it probably would have cried. I literally had to rip the roots out. So I'm gonna tell you in God's word in 2 Corinthians 5 and 17, it says, therefore, if any man be in Christ, he is a new creature. Old things are passed away. Behold, all things become new. That's literally what God does for us. When we come to him, he uproots anything that is not like him. He replants you and he grows you into this amazing person. You become who he has called you to be. So we have to give ourselves to God 
so he can make new creatures in us. And once you allow him to do that, you are going to be the most amazing person that you have ever seen. Thank you so much for visiting my channel. Please don't forget to hit the subscribe button below. I hope you come back to visit again. I love you beautiful people.